The quarterback mixing things up at the line of scrimmage. Second and short following the run. They feed him the ball again. Loops around him. There's a player down on the field. Trainers on their way out. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is, I think he's going to be okay. And once he gets a little um, uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. Yeah, the draw play, it's been around forever, and it is still a valuable asset to all offenses. Make the defense think past. You hand it off, you get them retreating, and you can pick up a few extra yards. He's looking to the right here on this throw, and it's knocked down, incomplete. Good job that time by the quarterback. Gets out of the pocket fast and not able to make the throw for the completion. Run. This should be the last play of the quarter. He'll go ground. Blindly spins away from the hit. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Another carry here. Spins away from the tackle. Good job by the offense getting another first down. You can tell by looking down on the field, the defense, hands on their knees. They are getting tired. Play number six coming up on this drive. Play clock's running down, staying on the ground. That tackle was made at the 27-yard line. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Second down and eight, back to the ground. Breaks free. He's brought down at the 25-yard line. Well, this team is definitely committed to the run. There's no doubt about it. And when you're committed to the running game, hey, a lot of them are not going to work. That's okay. Stay with it. Snap back to the quarterback. Out of the gun. Going across the middle. The tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. Uh, there's nothing the defense can do. When you talk about a receiver like these guys out there now, and, and this one in particular, the double coverage, they're still able to go in between the defenders, rise up, and make the catch. Here's the handoff. Running off tackle. And here's a look at their red zone percentage to this point, which is brought to you by Verizon. Verizon, rule the air. This drive now about to reach the 10th play of the series. Looks around. Makes the grab. Touchdown. What a throw by the quarterback for a touchdown. It was just really nice. He threw it beautifully, right on target. Touchdown. First and ten. The give. He's in the clear, and he's tackled at the 32-yard line. With the carry on the play. Offense lines up here. Another handoff. Gains five. That's a timeout call. The safety up in the box here. Takes the knee. That'll stop the clock with that timeout. Now they'll try over again on second down. Look at the safety here, moving up at the last moment.
takes the knee. This one could have gone either way. Each side made some spectacular plays, but we've come to an end, and what a game it was. And coming up next is the post-game wrap-up, brought to you by Gatorade, G-Series Recover, giving you the protein you need to rebuild your muscles. Everbank Field will be playing host for this AFC versus NFC matchup between the Lions and the Jaguars. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. Do we have a little upset special coming your way today? One team's unbeaten. Well, I know the undefeated team hopes not, but I'll tell you, Jim, the other team, they're excited about getting out there and getting the chance to put that first blemish on the record. You're always looking for an edge, and when you go against an undefeated team, that's a big edge for your football team. This has been an incredible stretch. A seven-game winning streak riding into this one. Well, seven games in a row. I mean, I played 15 years. I think I had two times where we won that many games in a row. It tells you a lot about the football team. They have talent everywhere. The coaches on top of all situations. They're not afraid to gamble in tough, tough spots. They're going to be tough to beat here today, too. Hot! 
Now first and ten. Quarterback drops back, play action. That pass was hurried. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. Running away from the sack. Knocked away, incomplete. You got to be smart on the defensive side now here, third and long. Be a little careful. Maybe give up a short pass or a short run. And if they throw it short, make sure you come up and make the tackle. Airing it out. Here's the pass, and it's broken up incomplete. I think that's the hardest pass a defensive back has to defend. The long throws down the field. You have to wait to the last second to make your play. That time, the defensive back did it. What a play. Set up the turn. Here he goes. Ohio! Ohio! Flex Brown! Flex Brown! First and ten. Maurice Jones Drew gets it here. He's got a wide open alley. And the tackle was made at the 48-yard line. Nice job by the offense picking up that first down here to start the game, and that is important to give you a little confidence, to give you some rhythm, and most of all, just release some of that pressure you feel. Scanning the field. Indomitian Sue has the sack. Quarterback made a big mistake that time. Don't carry out the play-action fake when you know you're under pressure. He tries to do it. It results in the sack. The offensive line gets in position. Can they protect their quarterback? Trying to work the middle of the field. Tackle down at the 47. Nice job by the quarterback. Finding the open guy short. They get the completion. They still do not get the first down, though. Third down after the completion. Three-step drop. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Defense is about discipline. And when you lose discipline, Big plays happen. That time, the defensive pass rushers, a little overzealous. They get out of the rush lanes. The quarterback gets outside and makes the play. They'll go shotgun here, running for his life. The throw to the left, inaccurate with that one. This First down and 10. Maurice Jones Drew. He's going to be tackled right around the 49. When you see a long run like that, you know what it does? It just breaks the will of the defense. In the NFL, that's all about passing. We see all these wonderful things. But when it comes down to it, who can win the war up front? And you win the war by running the football. Great job by the offensive line that time. The name of the game is hit the guy with the football. The quarterback has it. The defensive end, what a job by him. Gets by the tackle and sacks the QB. At that counter. Gains 11. Good job that time by the running back. I'm sure he's a little winded after that play. He showed that speed getting out there and picking up those extra yards. They bring in an extra defensive back.
Let's round! Let's round! Ohio! Ohio! Third and a long way to go. Gets away from the heat. That pass it looks like a little miscommunication. You got to find ways to avoid sacks in the NFL. Two ways to do it. Run away from them because you got speed or good footwork inside the pocket. Nice job that time by the quarterback. Avoiding the sack and getting rid of the football. Going to try his luck here. Now we reach the two-minute warning here in the second quarter. First and ten. He's scrambling down. Breaks free. He is brought down at the 49-yard line. They face first down. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. Looking to go deep. Makes the catch in the end zone. Touchdown. There's no doubt about it. When you score like that to tie up the game, it shifts momentum. And it's all up now to the offense of the other team to get back out there and get the momentum back on their side. First and ten. Looking at every option. Going for the home run. The ball's deflected incomplete. They call that the moment of truth. It's a beautiful throw down the field, but the defensive back, he waits until it's time to make that jump. He defends the pass. What a good job by the defensive back. Second and ten. Here's the handoff. Maurice Jones drew. An off tackle run. It's a staple of all offenses in the NFL. And a general rule is you run off the right tackle because he is the power tackle where the left tackle is the pass blocker. He's going to be tackled right around the 46-yard line. Well, it's about deceiving the defense, isn't it? That's how you get a lot done in the NFL. And when you can run and pass, you can deceive them in a lot of ways. Nice job by the offense running that football, picking up another first down and moving the chain. The pass had to be perfect. And now will be on the other side of the 50 after this play. Quarterbacks love play action passes because the defense, sometimes they're expecting run. You fake it, easy completion down the field. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Number 32, the ball carrier on the play. No gain on the play. Ohio! Ohio Two tights go! for this play. Second down and 10. The quarterback throws to the right. That catch will keep the drive alive. Good job getting the first down by the offense. And look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. Maurice Jones-Drew gets it here. Has a terrible read by the running back. It's a short game, but it's all his fault. He picked the wrong hole. He should have cut it back. He didn't, and that's why he was tackled. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. He fires it in there tight. Good job by the quarterback completing that pass against the zone defense. Look for the open space when you throw against zones. That's what he did, and he got the nice completion. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Running away from the pressure. Reaches in, knocks it away. Jim, that was really a, a terrific job by the quarterback. The pocket is breaking down, and look at that. He just steps up, moves out. Good job of keeping the play alive. The kick is good. Yep. Ohio! 
good. First and ten. Surveys. What a catch. For so many years, get all these rinky deep, deep, and dunk quarterbacks. Now we've got guys in there throwing it deep down the field. What a nice catch. What a really good deep throw. The quarterback is coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. And it's knocked down. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. The defense comes out in the nickel from the shotgun. Trying to work that left side. Not giving up another inch. Find a way to score. That's always the mantra that every team when they get in the red zone. If you punch it in here, even though you're down by more than seven, it'll give you confidence for the rest of the game. Drop back, shotgun formation. No one is touchdown. This game is tight. It's commonplace now. It's hard to even say the word great for a catch by the wide receiver. We see so many of them. But this one, that is a great catch. They're going to the hurry up offense and they're back to the line quickly. He made it. Time's becoming a factor in this one where the Lions lead by four. First down and 10. Maurice Jones drew. Gains 17. When you see a long run like that, you know what it does? It just breaks the will of the defense. In the NFL, it's all about passing. We see all these wonderful things. But when it comes down to it, who can win the war up front? And you win the war by running the football. Great job by the offensive line that time. First and ten, and they go back to the ground. Looks like a gain of three, maybe four. Number 32. And now we reach the two-minute warning. Gain of four. Flex round! Flex round! Ohio! Ohio! The defense at this point, trying to keep him out of the end zone. Looking to the right side and throwing. Makes the catch. Touchdown. Nice throw. contested contest that has now come to a conclusion. And coming up next is the post-game wrap-up, brought to you by Gatorade G-Series Recovery.